Welcome back once again. In this part, we will solve some design issue for our navigation drawer. So, for example, if you want to do white color of our navigation drawer icon, then how can we do it? So, for doing this, first we need to open our style folder, and in here we need to add our custom style. So now we need to see how can we do this. So in inside this style, now we need to add a item, and we can call it item window action bar false and add another item we can call it window no title is true now we need to create another style and call it name we can call it drawer icon style and at parent is going to be widget dot app compact dot drawer toggle and inside this we need to add an item and we can add a color and we can choose android color white and this color will give us white color icon now we need to call this one inside our main style file so we can call it item name drawer arrow style and style is going to be our name of our style that is that we created now run these apps and try to log in again and Hopefully we will see white icon. So edge it at the rate gmail.com and add password. And add a password. We can call it 12345678 and click login button. And now we are in our home activity and we can see we can see white color icon so I think we successfully implement our navigation drawer and bottom navigation view still we need to work on fragment but we just add but we just complete all this design field Now open this activity home and in here I think we need to change some color so we can add item text color is going to be android color white we can, choose, we can, we can select this navigator color instead of white color and open this main activity we need to write two line of code for for our login so if mauth dot get current user not equal to null that means if we already registered inside in a android device then we don't need to we don't need to log in each and every time so this two line of code will give us this facility now we need to start activity new intent get application context and we will redirect to our home activity dot class so now we don't need to now we can see we are in our home activity and we can see our navigation drawer and our bottom navigation view so this way we will not need to log in each and every time when we will install when we will run our application so that is the main facility of using this two line of code for our firebase auth so i think that's it for this part we will continue it from our next part thank you